Hi, I'm Paul Friedman and welcome to the channel. If you're here for the first time, you should definitely subscribe right now because this is where you learn marriage the right way. I know that sounds awfully cocky, but it's true. I used to be a divorce mediator. That was over 22 years ago. And when a couple asked me to help them save their marriage instead, I really discovered marriage and it just is mind boggling. And that's why we now have a nonprofit. The Marriage Foundation is nonprofit. A fellow medi mediator friend of mine was a Navy SEAL said, Paul, this stuff is amazing. We got to get it out there. And I said, okay. And we he put up a thousand bucks right away. We went to a lawyer and created this foundation. And we've been helping so many people. So this topic is interesting. This topic is why does my wife question everything I say? And I'm going to give you the big picture because the little picture is useless. You know, I don't do things as a Western psychologist because I'm not one. And we even train Western psychologists who are marriage counselors and clergy how to become real marriage counselors by using our principles. So. I'm not going to get into she questions things because of this, because of that. I'm going to say the reason why she's questioning everything is because it's her way of demonstrating her unhappiness in your marriage. Does that mean your marriage is about to fail? No, but most marriages do fail. You know that, right? Over 50%. That's why being a divorce mediator was so lucrative. But yours doesn't have to. You need to understand that if you take your marriage apart and you fix this and you fix that, it's not going to be fixed because you basically got like the Maserati of situations. A marriage is an amazing thing. It is like highest end possible. And I know there's better than Maseratis, but I use that as an example. And you got in this Maserati and you turned on the sound system and you never even hit the start button. And that, because we don't understand marriages, we don't learn about marriage growing up. We don't learn about ourselves growing up. Define yourself. Oh, I'm a human being. That's not defining. What are you? So in order for me to understand marriage, I had to understand that too. We teach that too. If you go to our website, you'll see there's a lot of free offerings. There's also things that are affordable and it's important for you to learn. You can learn so much from these videos, these YouTube videos. And what it is, is you're a soul. And that's why you met your wife as your soul mate because we're souls. This is not just a hallmark thing. You have a mind, you have a body. We are a blend on the surface of it, but you're essentially a soul, a very spiritual being. And what happens is when we meet our soulmate, the intention that God had, I'm speaking for God right here, is that he wanted us to experience the joy that he's given us innately and the love. And that's what marriage is all about. We get married to be happy. We get married to be living in love, floating in this. And, and we can do that. Been doing this for 22 years, helping people with this. So I know it can be done. But you don't start by saying, oh, well, this is wrong and that is wrong. You start by realigning yourself with what marriage is all about. So you have to learn it. And so when you go, oh, my wife questions everything I say. Well, that's just a manifestation of her unhappiness. And if your marriage was amazing and she questioned everything you said, it wouldn't even bother you because you'd go, it's all right, no big deal. I am living my married life to experience happiness and love. You see, and it transcends all of the crap on the mundane level. Do you see what I'm saying? It's really very cool. I mean, when I broke it down, I didn't do this in a week. 
it took a long time for me to really understand marriage. In fact, even after I started to understand it mechanically, it took years and years before it kind of all came together and gelled, you know? And so now we've got it at the Marriage Foundation and we're training therapists and we're training clergy to be real marriage counselors who really understand marriage because it's all about love. It's all about happiness and you have free will, but you have to understand all of the parts of who you are and what it is so you can put it together in your own marriage. Don't be satisfied with the reason she's questioning everything you say is because. Don't be satisfied with that. Change your whole marriage. Change your whole thinking about your marriage. Expect happiness and don't expect it from her and expect love and don't expect it from her. And I'm gonna leave you with that. Hopefully you subscribe. Hopefully you like this video. Hopefully you get it and you want to go further. That is my hope for you. I mean, this is a nonprofit for a reason. We're doing this as a service to help people. So I hope you think it's cool. You could leave a comment if you'd like. You could go to our website. You could ask a counselor. There's all kinds of stuff. I appreciate your coming by, and I hope you visit again. Thank you. Now again, I'm Paul Friedman. I'm the founder of the Marriage Foundation. God bless you, and take care.